ทีนี้อ่ะเอเลสโซบาวเปียวจ่ามะเลยสู่แล้วมะเนี่ยรีดิ้งนี่เนี่ยตะไซน์เนี่ยบ่เนาะตัวอ่ะดีโกดิยู
here. This is one of the charts that he has in the uh, in, in, in one of the chapters where he's showing there, there are sorts of uh, three groups of banks there. New York, Chicago, and St. Louis, he says, are special. They, they are required by law to hold 25% reserves. And you can see that he's showing their deposits, 825 uh, millions of dollars, okay, in deposits in New York, 262 in Chicago, 116 in St. Louis. These are the main banking cities in the United States. There is no central bank at the time that he's writing. This is before the Fed, okay? so so. This is, this is, he doesn't actually say exactly what date this, this came from, okay, but it's before, it's before the Fed. And um, so they have deposit accounts. Those deposit accounts are liabilities of these banks. To, to some extent, the Central Bank of the United States was the collection of banks in New York. You see how they have most of the deposits, and you're talking here about J.P. Morgan and his buddies, okay? And they're the ones who are doing international transactions. New York is very much the center where, where the United States banking system faces Europe. They're required to hold reserves in lawful money, um, and that means green pieces of paper, basically, um, uh, currency, um, at least for these central banks, the, these banks in New York, Chicago, and St. Louis, and you can see that's how much they have, classification of reserve. Um, lawful money in the bank, 218 million, 66, 26 there, and there's the percentages. 26.8% um, is in New York, 25%. They, they were required by law, he says, to hold 25% of their deposits in lawful money. So there's a, there's a reserve requirement. The second group, other reserve cities, so this is Boston, this is Chicago, not Chicago, um, uh, San Francisco, other important cities, Kansas City, um, that also have our money center bank, but not as important as these other three, are also required to hold 25% reserves, but they can hold some of their reserves as deposits in New York, okay? And that's what that second column is there, due from reserve agents, okay? So there's this sort of layering, and then there's the country banks, okay, which are small banks, 6,000 of them, okay? The United States had just lots and lots of little banks, um, which are, have to hold 15% reserves, and they can hold them partly in, in, in cash, 199 million there, and partly in other reserve cities or in New York. Okay, so that's 226 million. So there's, the, there's this layering where country banks are holding their reserves as deposits in their local money bank, okay, which is holding its reserves in New York, okay, which is holding its reserve in lawful money, which is either green piece of paper or gold, I should, I should say. That's, it's the gold standard at this time. Okay, hierarchy, you can see that. A B. ပြီးဝါးလေပြီးကြောင်းလည်းလည်းလေးထောင်မိနော်အဲ့လက်ဆိုပြီးဒစ်ကပ်စ်လုပ်ဖို့ Okay, young TV. Okay, no? okay LS got to be how LS now let the chat and your piano So I dig up Georgia, Dimas, or in our son, Lumio, the for a result, Lumashi, the one. I ဒီမျိုးတွေမှာရှိတယ်ပေါ့เนาะဒါအတစ်ချက်ပေါ့ကလေးရာနှစ်တိမယ်ဆိုရင်သူကပြောနေတဲ့ကန်ထရီဘန
ตัวเนี่ยเอาที่ง้าบ่มันชื่อบ่เนาะตัวกูรันเต็งหน้าเมดาหมดเลยฟิลเวอร์รีเซอร์บ่บ่อีซันเวอร์บ่มาตัดเ
ตุมาชีบางเมื่อไม่ชื่อตัวอะไรเต็งอยู่เต็งนามเนี่ยบลูนี่บลูฮาเมื่อเนี่ยอยู่เต็งนามเนี่ยส่วนนี้ตุโก
Okay, so it's trading. You can have my deposit accounts, I'll take your bonds. Okay, and the banking system, all that's happening is you have a debit to the deposit account of the private sector and a credit to the deposit account of the uh, government. So you're just, in the, within, the, within the banking system, there's just a transfer of ownership of a deposit account. Okay, this is all easy peasy, but we start easy and then it gets more convoluted, okay? Notice that the total quantity of deposits in the banking system doesn't change. You're just changing the ownership of some deposits. Then the government spends these, and in doing so, it's buying more goods from the private sector. So it's transferring these deposits back to the private sector, okay, and, and using them to buy more goods. So that's a good, good thing. It's war finance, right? You're trying to get more resources. If the government can sell bonds, so good. Okay. But if the government can't sell bonds or is worried that the private sector is going to require way too much interest or something like that, okay, then instead of trying to sell them to the private sector, okay, it might uh, sell them directly to the banking system, okay, or by taking out a loan from the banking system, like this. So let's say this is version one, this is version two, okay, plus deposits, plus bonds, well, he'll, here we'll say a loan instead, okay, but a, a loan is, is sort of like a, a, a bond. It's a, it's a promise to pay at some future date. Um, but it's not a security. It's, n it's not uh, something that's saleable uh, in, in the open capital market. And it's just borrowing this directly from the banking system. And this is a swap of IOUs. Why do I say that? The bank is saying uh, to the government, I owe you, um, oh, let's put some actual numbers there, uh, $150 million, because this is exactly what Sam and P. Chase did, okay? In uh, August of 1861, August of 1861, he went to the big New York bankers and he said, please lend me some money. They said $150 million, that about do it? Yeah, that's fine. So he had this loan of $150 million. So they created a deposit account for, for the government, for, for Mr. Sam and P. Chase, saying, um, I owe you $150 million. Okay? And the government wrote a little note here saying, no, I owe you $150 million. Okay? The government owes in 10 years or five years. Um, I don't think Young tells us the term of the loan. Okay? Um, but this is a demand deposit. Okay, this is this is this is private money. Okay, and it's been created from thin air. You see, it's an expansion of both sides of the balance sheet. I call this quantitative easing. Okay, um, the, the banking system is buying the government bonds. It's buying the government bonds because the government is not so sure it can get the private sector to buy them. There's no involvement of the private sector here at all. Right in this second in this second maneuver. Okay, it's all completely a relationship between the banking system and and the government. There is no central bank. Remember, this is this is before the central. This is before. This is civil war. This is 1861. Okay. This is what Sam P. Chase did, and then he pulled a bit of a fast one on the banking system. Okay, on the on these New York bankers, instead of taking these deposits and transferring them to Americans to buy war material, you know, boots and cloth and food for the soldiers and stuff, okay? He withdrew them. He said, oh, 
these are my deposits. You promise to pay me on demand. Okay, I demand. Give me $150 million. Give me $150 million in gold, please. In gold, please. I haven't put this in the banking system, but there, is gold, there are gold reserves, okay, that are being held by the banking system. And so the New York banks had to do that. And they did do that. Okay. Minus gold. Minus deposits. Okay. Minus deposits plus gold. $150 million worth. Okay. Now, why did Sammy P. Chase did that? He did that because he wanted to be able to buy $150 million worth of stuff from abroad, from foreigners. Okay. They're not interested in dollars, they're interested in gold. And so he wanted to, at the very beginning of the war, make sure that all the gold in the United States was in his pocket, okay? So that he could, he could buy whatever he wanted from England. Um, and this was turned out to be rather key, actually, to the success of the war. The South had to always do barter deals, actually, with, with, in, in, in terms of, with cotton. It would ship cotton and get war material from Europe, okay? Whereas the North could pay in, in gold. So this was a key, a key thing. Okay. However, one consequence of this was to suck all of the gold reserves out of the banking system and therefore make them illiquid, make them unable to pay other, any other deposits in gold. Okay? They, they, and so they immediately suspended, suspended their uh, specie payments. They refused to pay deposit accounts in gold government took all the gold, they didn't have any more gold, so the U.S. went off the gold standard, right there, right at that moment, because Mr. Sam and P. Chase sucked all the gold into his own, into his own pockets. You want to come with me, but I don't know. Let's all get it. Money told me it's a song, huh? Okay, I don't know, baby, so I let's do the amulet down, huh? Okay, continue. The other question is, man, it'll be an arrow sheet. Question don't cook the arrow, sorry. ตัวดีวิดีโอมาอะมาเลยไอ้ของสวยมากเลยเป็นตั้งจะผิวเลยเนี่ยเดี๋ยวมีมั่นดาวก่อนอาจารย์เลยเนี่ยเดี๋ย
ဒီစီဘဝောဆာသူတို့ဒီအရှိအတောင်းနှိုင်းများသူတို့ရန်မြင်မာနိုင်ငံပါဆိုတော့တိုင်းတိုင်းမြီတခုနဲ့တခုတ
ပြီးတော့ဘာဒွားလဲခင်ကတော့ပစန်ကြီးနဲ့ပြီးတော့ဘာဒွားလဲခင်ကတော့ပစန်ကြီးနဲ့ငါပစန်ငါဝေးတ
Yang gaun sah ni, nala gaun sah. Kau semua kau mesti dia mana ni nala, buat na finance kau lalu jalan, buat kau dah bermain swing, buat dah kau tu dah bermain lalu dah pun ada, buat kau ni dia kuat finance kau lalu dah swing, buat kau ni dia kuat dia kuat bermain swing. Tua, mula se elah semua mana yang dia masuk, ini ni 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 ada apa sih mana so di. กงเจนทั้งกงนี้ใส่ยงนี้ใส่ยงนี้ที่เอามาใส่ยงนี้เราเนี่ยเปลี่ยนลงเลยพอเลยบ้านเนาะแล้วเนี่ยตัวเปล
hello, jalan tu ya. Saya jalan tu ya. Eh, jalan. Oh, emak, jono saya saya bising nama dia, wanai nak punya pada dia. So, emak ya, jono lu, di jono suai di bengis sini nama pada dia, lu doai lu, ni ni tu suai tu, lu nak balu dia. Jono lu biru cuma dia, wanai tu pelak pelak jui jui dia, lu pelak pelak sahaja. Apa yang apa pelak jui mide mari, pelak lu dah bari, sahaja macam jono nak jom dia aja. Eh, so. Kena boleh li, eh, itu kena boleh di suka bayar ni, bukan kita setan ni, betul. Best time itu aje, mana? Ini ini suka itu mana? Jono kena betul ya. Ah, so, eh, udin sing, eh, hujur, jono sesat sena, mana mal mana mana, mana? Betul. Eh, mana tu kena betul? Udin sing itu aje, betul. Best time itu. Eh, 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 mana kena betul? Dua, ah, belau cium dia mana? Betul. Belau sesat pun jono, naujah mana biar dia? Betul. Jodoh aje, mana? Jono mesti lay out, mana? So, eh, mana? Orang kuat. Ah di kena boleh dulu ah aku nak bayar tu di oh belum 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 le di public private barang asyik bu ni apa macam tu kena boleh suka ni boleh tu ni aku ah emak ah dia kuat le kau ni usi lah boleh macam mana aja so ah biar le biar kena boleh tu di buku dia kena ibu no suka ni boleh macam tu yang ni ah di buku kena boleh beli dulu ya kena boleh di private sada tu di ah tu ye ah tu pasang ya bu yang ni biar emak kena boleh private sada ni boleh tu di ah Pilih hal yang dia tahu dua, bagi sesuatu yang dia tahu dia juga boleh dapat mampu dia. So, ini mah dua. So, yang macam tu, ini semua tu jadi. Tu yang ni dia, tu yang le, ni ha sahuri bayar tu, tu mana tu le bayar tu. Kena boleh di bawah dia kena ni dia, tu ada juga dia. Juga tu, kena boleh. Macam minyak yang ada di bawah dia. Ada tu, ini ni dia, dia kena jual dia. Tu yang le, yang Nenek ini ada ngah raga dek awal ni, mian ibu di kroni dia, bayi ni macam mana boleh? Ayat jero, ayat abah mada galai, dia ni jero, kong kono, alupi ya lah. So, ayat tu, kenapa boleh? Ayat mada nak kuah, kenapa jono sini ada mana? Kenapa abah mada tu ni, kenapa tu lah? Di beli beli ni, so ayat ni dah, bila kenapa tu? Bukli kan ada ni, tu ni di, bukli kan ada ni, kenapa tu ya thana, kenapa boleh? So ayat tu ya thana tu jawab tu korang sini ni, mungkin agak jenah, dasar musim ni, so bukli kan ada ni tu di bawah ni. Ah, eh, ya lu sih, so degilan yang aku nak buat di, aku nak buat eh, sujawa sujawa tu dia, eh, di belum time ye, tu pasang lah, so lu jenah, eh pasang lah, degil yo tu ni ni, tapi pih doa lah bukan di, soya, so eh mah aku nak buat eh mata malay, aku nak buat lu nenek lido aku nak buat lu, ane jadi sih ya lu, eh, so eh dudia mata jaro le, aku nak buat lu dua, ma ma malay aku nak makan lu juga, aku nak buat lu dua le. Tu log tu ada jangwari, tu jangwari lima kali dia ambil dia. So, and, ane pada video tu jangwari emaru ni ni kayak dia aja ni, mana perlu perlu ni ni dia. Ni dia macam, wah, bermata betul tu, wah pasal ni lah, wah alam lo kau kau bermata macam si lagu tu jangan ni aku awal so, wah di wen wen situasi ni polis dia cakap aja, dia cuy ti ma, dia cuy ta ma, elem pun dia ni pun dia ni aja, mana aku awal di Kalau mana yang integran tu dia korai, bukan orang tu belau pun ada yang tabung si dia, tu belau ni nak tabung apa ini? Ah, ya lah, yang ini dia, orang tu jom nyuhar dia terus orang tu. Tu polis itu kucah macam orang tu, orang tu pelbagai sahaja orang tu, orang malah dah orang tu bengi sahaja orang tu dah itu ada na. Alam nyuhar dia tu, tu konsekuensi dia tu, tu cara dia senarai orang tu, tu 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 macam tu lepas yang si bar, ni semua hal tu jadi macam apa orang tu ke? Orang tu pun macam senarai macam ni siapa macam orang tu, orang tu ni macam ni macam orang tu, tu ke? Pidu dia cuci dalam mana? Kau yang siapa? Kau nanya dia kulung ya, bukan? Cungong itu cibir. Tu kalau orang belum ni di konsep konsep kau sayap sayap, bukan? Jom ni ada ni orang ni zaman cerita hal tu, jutong jutong senar, bukan? Dia ha, orang sayap sayap orang mesti usram, orang mesti lau pulu esok ni ni. Macam ni, macam ni ada lau pulu ni 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 ada reduce kalau senar tu, bukan? Dah alat pasti ni, bukan? Kau nak dia ada relation macam ni mana? Nampak tak dia boleh misal ni lah, bukan? Dia awak kau nak kalau dia tak bilang. Masa awak suka melayu belum nyawa hari, tu cuma lom lom ni dia hari dia sih dia, bukan? Dunia finance lom dia hari dia sih dia, bukan? Jadi nak, okay, bawa kalau saya belajar tu cuma ni, lo. Oh, bawa biasa ni, tu nak aku ni, nak video tu keluar tuan ni, no? Ikan, ada semua ni ada lagi ada lagi ni ni perasa dia ada tu tuan ni, ada semua anjala, bukan? Asam biji alam dia alam. Mana cuma ni asam biji alam. Okay, ma. Ya, so malah malah di kau nak di hari itu kau dah bincang sesi bini malah anda ada mana, babi di hari tu ada bami. Lucu, lucu, macam apa?
you're not going to do this again. <laughs> the banks are not, are not going to fall for this twice. Okay, so what do you do now? Okay, the second thing that Sam and P. Chase did was something called legal tenders or the greenbacks. And I brought to class today a my own proud possession. The top one here is uh, is a greenback. Okay, that's authorized by the Act of March third, eighteen sixty three. It's not the first greenback act. I think it was the third the third one. Ultimately, they issued. They were uh, ultimately Congress. The Treasury was authorized to issue four hundred million dollars worth of this stuff. Okay, these are dollar bills that say on the top of them, "This note is a legal tender for one dollar." Okay, and what that means is nothing. You, 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 you can't get gold for this. You can just exchange it for another dollar bill, okay? That's it, okay? The U.S. is off the gold standard. It's not legal tender for, for anything except payments within the United States. You're not, you're not allowed to refuse this as payment for a debt in the United States. So let's just now play this out, the second, the second phase, and understand how, how this worked. Okay, so we, we're running out of room there. So let's start here again with the same set of balance sheets. We have the government, we have the private sector, we have the private sector, and we have the um, banking system. Um, Young is, by the way, in these passages, drawing heavily on the work of his, of his friend, um, Wesley Clare Mitchell, who wrote a great book called The Greenbacks about this whole period, um, which I've assigned sometimes, in, in, not in this class, but in, but in other classes where we're reading great texts. Wesley Clare Mitchell, I see no recognition of this name at all, okay? But he was a very famous professor here at Columbia, and he taught, he taught here for many, many decades, okay? And he was, a, a, he was basically one of, one of Alan Young's best friends, they grew, up, they grew up together and went to, went to graduate school together and so forth. So he's leaning on the historical research and quantitative research. Wesley Clare Mitchell was one of, the, one of the founders of the National Bureau of Economic Research, as a matter of fact, which is a big, big deal here, big American institutionalist quantitative economist. Okay. That's just an aside. So how do legal tenders work? Legal tenders work this way, okay, that the uh, government is, the uh, is buying war goods from the private sector for legal tenders. It's just giving them these pieces of paper here, and I'll write that number 400 million. There were not actually 400 million ever totally issued, but almost 400 million were, were issued, so it's, it's a lot of money there. Okay, that's what the private sector so the private sector is accepting this. In payment, um, and the and the uh, government is getting the war goods, so the government gets war goods here as its own asset, and it is printing these legal tenders here. Okay. Young is pretty aghast at this. You can see in this in this uh, in this article. Government's under pressure. If it, you're fighting a war, you do what it takes to win the war. Okay, so and he appreciates that, but you'll see there's a there's a better way to do this, which is the which we're going to come to in the third one. <coughs> Probably Sam and P. Chase underestimated the bond market um, at, at this time, but so he starts to print money. And what happens to these legal tenders is that they get deposited in the banking system, or some of them, um, because the banking system still exists. So I'm going to say, just for example here, so this is stage one, that uh, the private sector is taking this $400 million worth of, worth of, of greenbacks, and they deposit uh, $100 million in the bank. Deposited in the bank, 
The legal tenders then become the asset of the banking system, and it's the legal tenders that become the reserves of the banking system. So that if somebody is withdrawing their deposit, they're withdrawing their deposit not in gold, but in these legal tenders. Essentially what Sam and P. Chase did in the hierarchy of money was to insert this sort of uh, legal tender money in between gold and deposits, okay? To, to insert it at the top of the US hierarchy, okay? Um, and uh, as, a, as a form of war finance, 400, 400, million, 400 million dollars here. This had, uh, you could never use these legal tenders, by the way, to buy uh, foreign war goods. Okay, that's what the gold was for, okay? This is to buy domestic war goods, okay? Foreigners, if you, if you try to uh, use, use legal tenders to buy things, they're gonna say, well, but what's the gold value of these legal tenders? Let me, let me trade this for gold. And so he makes a big deal that throughout the war, the value of these legal tenders kept falling relative to gold, okay? Um, and they eventually fell to 50 cents on the dollar so that there was, there was this exchange rate effect through the falling value of the, through the falling value of the dollar internationally. There's also uh, domestic inflation. The price level is rising uh, domestically as a consequence of this too, because the, the government is basically buying things without making anyone else buy anything less, okay? So it's, it's not, whereas here, when you're, when you're saying, I'm gonna give you a bond, you're gonna give me your deposits, you're reducing the purchasing power of the private sector, here, here, you're just adding purchasing power that didn't exist before. Okay? And the consequence of this is to depreciate the value of these legal tenders relative to the pre-war uh, par. Mm -hmm. ไอ้ลองเปลี่ยนอะไรซะเอาเนาะโอเคบ้าโอเคน้องๆเลยพี่มีส่วนอะไรซะเอาเนาะสุดที่มาดิครับเปียวว่าดีลีเกตันน่
position power lah le, remain the same. Kau ada yang bermain dolar dalam kita ni pasal amal kami ni lah macam tu. Tunggu ni nanti dah lari, bukan inflation ni cek lari. Kalau dia cek lari, bukan nak kau luar. Di pasal orang melu sini hanya cek lari. Kalau melu ni bukan luar psikologi ya lah cek luar. Kalau melu ni apa jadi melu sih melu ni apa pun ni nari hanya melu yang tua di melu ni apa yang tua kalau melu ni no kalau melu ni tua lari kalau orang melu tua di tak terus ni melu ni bukan. Dah elas nari tu ni ni jauh jauh. Kau tiap bulan nari lebih cepat jauh jauh di di belah kali ni pada video bukan. เอ่อมาอ่ะอ่าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้าเจ้
，然后见到又来压了。对对，股票新的新的，阿拉做了新的。哦。好，你他他让看，阿那那太紧了，是的，太比较紧了，联系吧，小宝。去呀，他们去玩，你玩来是不？哈哈，哎呦，哎呦，哎嘛，个这个弟弟，他们那个弟弟在那里做股做股市的股，股安尼话啊，我喏，就哎，就 private sector 安尼话就比较难咯。一般都比如嘛，买了六厘下，我中了半年没有标签啊，我讲就比如嘛，六厘下在下中半年没有，那边那个那边都都弄没有，我都没有报。哦。哦，你没听那吧？没听那里没得哦，阿拉拉没得。啊，好的，阿拉阿拉。哦，好的，你妈看到啦，我你妈没见你联系啦，人家刚说完啦。我们是有嘛？宝贝，阿你他们有爱嘛你？我们收嘛，马路边啊，公司来嘛。对吧？我问下那个。好，公司包。OK 吧，没有啊。不收嘛。OK， 阿叔，阿叔，你马上 stop 录啊，你听你聊好不啦？阿叔，你就是听马来，你们那边在那 discuss 录假了不？那，你你现在白天是在那边在比较，你听讲过，阿叔，听录假没？不呢？听下录听录假没？你们那边在呢？ So di ni di ni tu dolly ni tu dolly jauh sih, mana yang sesuai ni awal tu jual hal ya. Kau ni sih kau kau ni ni lah. Kau dia yang jadi tu ni lah. Kau sih ni ada ramai ni ya. Ada semua kau ni mana pada tinggal nama ni lah. Ada ada ramai ni mana yang sih ni kau sih ni ada tuh hal ni semua yang kau ni bukan. Ada semua mana yang jadi kau ni sahul dia pernah ni. Kau di mana kau awak tak ada mana yang pada dah halal ni lah tu ni. Semua kau tu tu hal ni sih awal. Ada semua jauh sih lo. Kau jadi tu mana lo nak kau no? Oh, cikgu ah. Ya, ni saya beli bawang, saya suruh dia beli bawang. Ada cuma hari yang ni sih minyak ada kopi. Ada cuma ni malu dia cuma dia beli 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 minyak beli minyak macam macam ni. Aku pakai yang cikgu dia beli. Cikgu dia beli elok. Mana tu kan orang cikgu dia beli elok. Cuma hari bumi beli beli bawang. Aku sih ni sih dia mana ada beli. Kalau dia kopi dia cium awal dia beli. Oh, baby. Alam cikgu dia beli. Ada cuma kopi nasi lalu beli bawang.